football. football. Introducing first, from Chelsea, Michigan, here to make you all pay the price, Tessa Price! And her opponent, from Des Moines, Iowa, the Hurricane Pro Women's Champion, the Killer Bay, Heather Monroe barking some orders to our, um, should I call him our, our senior cameraman out here, our senior photographer, Chad Cooper. Well, you know, as, as a woman, we know our best angles and we have to tell you men how to shoot us. I'm sorry, it's just facts. Based on that analysis, what would you say is Heather Monroe's best angle? Can I say it on TV? I can't. That's oh, what I'm okay. asking you. <laughs> I mean, you know, she's got a lot of great assets. Okay. Fair enough. Well, Heather Monroe, you know, I often brag about numbers here on Title Match Network, and I do that for good reason, because I'm very proud of what Title Match has accomplished. And this week, yet another video went viral featuring Heather Monroe and, of course, the Latin heartthrob Gino. You can see that inner gender encounter right now on our YouTube channel when you're done watching the first half of this matinee. This marathon of the All Women's Invitational, Ladies Night Out 9, coming at you all day long. I kind of feel a little bit like Jerry Lewis, might be before your time, but you know, he used to host a telethon and would go on all day long. I was like, where is he finding the stamina for this? I'm gonna need some damn coffee and soon. I mean, yeah, I mean, clearly the five hour energy isn't enough and yeah. I might not look it, but he is not before my time. Uh, so I, I understand the telethons and this is a, this is a, a uh, sprint, a marathon, a everything rolled into one. Well, I say that because I guarantee you still get carded. I don't. Okay, I leave. <laughs> I leave my wallet at home when I go to the bar now. So, the first half of our main, of our double main event here on the first half of Ladies Night Out Nine, featuring Heather Monroe and Tesha Price, and this is the first time these two athletes have ever competed against each other before. And Tesha, she has a vigor in her. I've, I've seen her wrestle all over the South and she's not one to just take lightly. And I feel like maybe Heather being the champion, she might feel a little bit cocky, a little bit more confident and she really needs to watch out for Tesha. that confidence that you were talking about, Brittany. Heather Monroe, not short on confidence whatsoever. And that's one of the reasons why she's achieved the success that she has. One has to assume that Heather Monroe has got to be on the short list of one of the big two companies in professional wrestling right now. I think it's only a matter of time, not if, but when, she will be signing a multi-year contract. Drag there from Tesha Price. Springboard, make it two. Ducks underneath. And scissors over the top. Tesha Price, clubbing blow downstairs. Follows up with a neck breaker. I mean, you gotta give it up for Tesha. You said that it's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when, when Heather Monroe signs a multi-year deal, but Tesha is hot on her heels on this. No doubt about that, and right now the only thing that Heather Monroe can do to break this wave of momentum from Tesha Price is to run away from her. She's just getting some cardio in. Oh! And the flowers are still standing, courtesy of Tesha Price. Heather Monroe just, she, she wants not a Tesha Price right now. 
Oh. And I spoke too soon. No, you're right. She still, she still doesn't want any of her. She tried to throw her to the fans to have the fans deal with her. Very unique athlete. She she has sort of this mid attempt here. One, two. She has sort of this quality of her. Reminds me a lot of Kawhi Leonard. You know, sort of moves very methodical. Doesn't seem like there's a lot of passion. And then all of a sudden she flips a switch and she drops 30 on you. And that's what we're seeing right now. You're talking about sports ball, aren't you? I am. Did get the analogy. I I'm guess sure. what I was trying to say <laughs> is that Heather Monroe is very impressive. There you go. I understand. I've heard the I've heard the name Kawhi Leonard several times, so. But I know wrestling. Well, I'm a self-described Clippers fan. Thank Billy Crystal for that. Cover here. One, two, and a kick out from Tesha Price, who looked like she had turned the tables on Heather Monroe, and then just like that, flips the script. Heather getting very vocal with the crowd there. standing and trading right now. That's a price with a shot to the side of the head there, forcing Heather Monroe to do her best impression of Deontay Wilder from last Saturday night. Shot right back to the temple again, same location, like she's drawn a bullseye on it, face buster. Heather Monroe maybe count the lights for three. Just kicks out. That's just it. Like Tesha is hungry. She wants that championship. She wants that status. Heather's already there, so she has a little less fight in her, I do believe. Tesha Price. Getting out of jail there and following up with a rodeo DDT off the second rope. Two. Kick out of two. Got stuck in traffic earlier from the Houston Livestock and Rodeo Show, and perhaps Tesha will be performing there later on tonight. I hear she's an avid fan. Well, right now it looks like she's doing some mutton busting in there. Waist lock from behind. Shot coming back here from Heather Monroe. Just in time for spring break. Cover two, kick out. That kick out, though, she did kick out. That was a very, very weak kick out. I think Tesha may be on the end of getting pinned here soon. I spoke too soon there inside Cradle. Schoolgirl this time from Heather Monroe. Int Sagiri. And if you Google Int Sagiri, you will get a picture of what you just saw. Beautifully done. The ropes are not Tesha's friend at this point. I have to agree with that 100%. It's Heather Monroe now. Michinoku driver, one, two, three. Heather Monroe with the dunk. 